Well, the action usually happens inside Parliament House in Canberra, but today it started outside. Security is usually incredibly tight here at Parliament House. Greenpeace opened the show with a stunt outside Parliament. Greenpeace protesters have managed to climb two flagpoles to unfurl a banner that is directly targeting the new Prime Minister, Scott Morrison. We're heading to Parliament to drop a banner on the first day of Parliament for Scott Morrison as PM. This is important to me because we've had a failure of leadership for over a decade on climate and Scott Morrison has showed that he's going to you know, betray the Australian people um, once again uh, because of, of his ties with the coal industry and we want that to stop. We're going to drive up, I'm going to get my ladder team out first, follow them up, climb up the pole set my anchors, come down and drop a banner, then hang out for a while and watch a really cool rally. Our government doesn't have a clear policy on climate change. It is pro-coal, shown by the cabinet that was chosen by Scott Morrison, our new PM. It's really sad because the overwhelming majority of Australians want to see renewables. They want to see our emissions reduced, but our government just isn't listening. My community lost 69 homes in a raging bushfire in March this year, and that's unprecedented. And that wasn't enough for them to take the issue seriously. I'm a farmer. We're already feeling the impacts of climate change. The time for debating climate change is finished. The time for discussing the best solutions to climate change, that's the opportunity that presents us now. It should be what the government are talking about, not about whether climate change is real or not. The coal industry and their lobbyists have taken over Australian Parliament. Australians didn't choose Scott Morrison and his pro-coal agenda. We want renewable energy. We want climate action now. It's time for us to resist. It's time for us to take action for a clean energy future. Authorised by D-Row 33 Mountain Street, Ultima, New South Wales, 2007.